Hello friends, welcome again to the world of maths by Amiya. So in this time, I'm not going to solve any question. This time I'm creating a question for you. Okay, so you can see thoda sa tiredness mere awaz mein hai. It's not that tiredness. I am feeling blue due to class class nahi ho pai. Today is the 24th Sunday. We had a planned class for the DI. But due to the net connectivity, class nahi ho pai hai. Mai is video ko upload karunga. Via my phone connection, so I don't know when upload will be. So if the class is not possible, then what I can do? You know, I am a maths trainer, I am a logical DI trainer. So if I am not able to take classes, the best I can do is create question. So this question I am creating in front of you. I have something in my mind, so I will create a question. Be with me during the question creation round. That is, we watch complete video till the end. And I would say please solve the question and please answers ko comment mein post karna aap. Okay, so this one is mainly targeting CAT 2019 if it's IMK. So I know if it's the K, it should be reasoning including the maths. Okay, so yeh ho sakta hai. But if you are targeting banking, you must solve this question because you know the banking is moving towards the MBA. If you're targeting the SSC, you should solve this question because it has some maths component. Which will improve your thinking power. Everything you, if you think you are an SSC aspirant and 2017 आपको अगर tough लगा है, तो इस question को आपको solve करना चाहिए. This would help you to think कि आगे maths में क्या-क्या हो सकता है, क्या नहीं हो सकता है. So this one is a mathematical reasoning कम DI question. Okay? So I am creating a question. मैं दिवान के जो भी है, मैं question create कर रहा हूँ. Be with me. आप video देखिए and at the end please post the Answers. अगर आप solve कर पाते हो तो fine. So I'm creating a triangle. So we have an equilateral triangle. Say मैं नाम दे देता हूँ A B C. So this one is nothing but an equilateral triangle. So name is A B and C. A B C is an equilateral triangle. Fine. I take any name. Say the Mr X is moving. On this triangle, Mr. X is moving on this triangle. Fine. Starting from A. Okay, Mr. X is moving from this triangle, starting from A. So from this point, Mr. X is moving, and in anti-clockwise direction. Fine. In anti-clockwise direction. So Mr. X is moving A to B, B to C. And A without any time loss. Without any time loss. What it means? It means Mr. X is moving in the continuous speed and it's A to B, B to C, C to A, then B, then C and A. It's a continuous journey without any time loss. Fine. Now I'm going to create a few more things. Say we have point P. We have point Q, we have point R, we have point S, we have point T, we have point U. So we have six points on a triangle P, Q, R, S, T, and just join these points. By joining these points, now the figure P, Q, R, S, T, U is a regular hexagon. It's a regular hexagon. Fine. So I'm trying to create a logical reasoning DI question with full of maths. We had equilateral triangle. Now we have a regular hexagon. So we have to think about the properties of triangle and the hexagon. Fine. Now, Mr. Y is starting at P on hexagon. Fine. Y is starting at B on hexagon in anti-clockwise only. In anti-clockwise. So I'm again repeating the question. Mr. X is moving on triangle ABC starting from A in the anti-clockwise direction. Mr. Y is starting at P and moving on a regular hexagon in anti-clockwise direction. So I'm just creating the question which is in my mind. So we have these two data. So we have Mr. X, Mr. Y, and they are starting from A and P and together. 
so this information is important they are starting together so they are starting together fine i hope it is clear now i am going to ask question before question i am giving you one more information they meet at s for the first time at s they meet for the first time and the information is in their first round of journey so now the question is they meet at s for the first time in their first round of journey what do you mean by the first round of journey उन्होंने अपनी जर्नी स्टार्ट ही की थी कि वो दोनों एस पे मिल गए पहली बार एंड दोनों ने स्टार्ट कैसे किया है टुगेदर सो यू हैव कंप्लीट इंफॉर्मेशन विथ यू वी हैव इक्टर ट्रैंगल एंड रेगुलर हेक्सागन एक्स भाई साहब स्टार्ट करते हैं ए से वाई भाई साहब स्टार्ट करते हैं बी से दे आर बोथ मूविंग टूगेदर दे स्टार्ट टेक टूगेदर एंड मूविंग इन दी एंटी क्लॉक वाइज डायरेक्शन एंड द मीट एट एस फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम दे आर मीटिंग एट एस इन द फर्स्ट जर्नी ये है now you have three questions and if you are able to solve these three questions i would say your maths means geometry your sequence and series your time speed distance your reasoning all should prove or you have to think ki isme kya kya ho sakta hai i'll post the solution as soon as possible to pehle aap isko solve karna so we have all the data with us now solve the three questions so our first question is when mr x reaches at a for first time where would be mr y this is the first question when mr x reaches at a for the first time where is mr y at some point or between some points if between some points then closer to which point okay so if mr x is reaching a at for, for the first time so why bhai sahab kahan pe honge this is your first question my second question is when mr y which is at p for first time where would be mr x नो क्वेश्चन ये मैं अब सेकंड क्वेश्चन करता हूं वाई हैज स्टार्टेड फ्रॉम पी अगेन वो अगर वापस पी पे पहुंच जाता है तो ए भाई साहब कहां पे होंगे एट सम पॉइंट बिटवीन सम पॉइंट इफ बिटवीन सम पॉइंट देन क्लोजर टू विच पॉइंट आई होप इट इज क्लियर नाउ माय थर्ड क्वेश्चन इज इफ मिस्टर एक्स रिस इज एट ए फॉर फोर्थ टाइम आई एम अगेन रिटर्न वट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ द फोर्थ पॉइंट सो आप जब पहली बार स्टार्ट करते हो तो उसे काउंट ही नहीं करते हैं सो वन राउंड स्टार्ट इज द वन काउंट टू थ्री एंड फोर अगर ये फोर्थ टाइम यहां पर पहुंचते हैं इफ मिस्टर एक्स रिच इज एट ए फॉर द फोर्थ टाइम वेयर वुड बी मिस्टर वाई इन दिस फिगर अगर भाई साहब एक्स भाई साहब फोर्थ टाइम पहुंचते हैं तो वाई कहां है If you are able to solve this question, I know your reasoning is good, your time speed is good, your geometry is good, and your analytical thinking is good. So I would say, please solve this question. आप वीडियो को दोबारा देखो अगर क्वेश्चन समझ में नहीं आता है तो दिस वॉज अ परफेक्ट क्वेश्चन फॉर द कैट टू थाउजेंड नाइनटीन इफ इट इज आई एम की अ परफेक्ट ट्रायल क्वेश्चन फॉर द एस एस सी एंड बैंकिंग इफ यू थिंक यू हैव टू वर्क समथिंग एक्स्ट्रा अगर आपको लगता है ये क्वेश्चन आपके लिए नहीं है तो आप क्वेश्चन को बंद कर दिए वीडियो को गाली देने से कोई फायदा तो होता नहीं है आपको जैसे आप सब हमेशा कुछ ना कुछ पोस्ट करते हो तो ओके तो आई वांट कि आप प्लीज इसे सॉल्व करो एंड अपना बेस्ट दो विथ ऑल बेस्ट विशेज माई सेल्फ अमी गॉड बेस्ट यू हैप्पी लर्निंग एंड बाय मैं बहुत जल्द इसका आंसर पोस्ट करूंगा आपके लिए ओके बाय